Okay, so today I'm going to mention a couple of swap outs that will help reduce the cost, cut down some grocery store expenses. Now, normally, as always, I'll always say there's nothing like the original, the real thing, but I'm taking a look right now. I'm showing you a bottle of imitation vanilla flavor, okay? Now, of course, I was always weaned on the real thing, and for the most part, that's what I usually use. However, some of the prices of that real thing, vanilla, if you will, can really be up there. So I said, just for the heck of it, let me try this brand. Now, this company, I was shocked to tell you this, for a whole whopping, let me get it right, eight fluid ounces, eight fluid ounces for this bottle of the imitation vanilla was only a dollar forty nine sitting or standing dollar forty nine. I says, let me let me give this a whirl to see. Honestly, it was not that bad. So um, let me see a dollar forty nine versus the much higher price original one. I'm not saying that this is better than the original one. There's nothing like the original one. But if you're trying to save a buck here, keep a buck there to get through your, you know, grocery bill, I rather save at this moment five or six dollars and get another um, couple of components for future meals. That's the way I feel about it right this minute. Like I say, the other thing can't beat it, but this is actually shockingly not so bad. Now, here's another item. I happen to love this. This is one of my favorite waters. It's a sparkling water by that company that I mentioned on a previous video. And basically it's sparkling water and it is delicious. And it's a little more expensive. I'd say, well, probably more expensive than let's say the canned version of seltzer or stuff like that. So here's, here's where you're better off. Again, if you want to compromise, take some swap out instead of getting this then you could consider getting uh, seltzer water, for example. Same thing, basically the bubbles and no calories, no sugar. Okay, I just happen to like this and I happen to be able to get it. So you see it's like a flip-flop here and a flip-flop there. It all depends on your budget. It depends on what you like. You know, we're not a one-size-fits-all society. And I just thought that I'd mention a couple of swap-outs that are entirely possible have you swapped out anything to cut down on expenses on your grocery bill? And if so, please let me know in the comment section below. All right, everybody. Have an amazing, fantastic day. Take good care. Bye-bye.